Hello and welcome. I am Arumba. Thank you for joining me. Let's play some more Factorissimo multiplayer with Steejo. Factorissimo. How are you doing, Steejo? I am well. I am very well. This mod is just... Yep. Re renewed your vigor for Factorio? <laughs> it Probably. wasn't like I'd lost any vigor for Factorio, but yeah. <laughs> it's pretty cool, dude. Yeah, this is awesome. This is this is the most fun I've had in Factorio in a, in, in a while. Yeah. Just, it really changes everything. Okay. And so then, do you have that factory? Do you want to come in here? I need that, that other factory. Uh, yeah, just give me a little second. Oh, fine if I have to. I'm just making a factory that makes pipes because I'm sick of pocket crafting them. Yeah, I've been making lots of pipes right now, making these extra 56 boilers. There we go. We've got a factory for pipes. Yay! Now we just need... I, we need another 60 steam engines. There you go. I, have, I have 10 in my pocket. We've got 10 outside right now. And we're going to make a factory that... This, this is actually going to make 40 megawatts, I think, of power. This is going to be 80 boilers. Uh, each, each set makes... Uh, each, each set of 10 makes 5 megawatts. Yeah, should, yeah it's fine. Yeah. So 40 megawatt factory building. And if I understand correctly, what you can do is you can copy the complete entity if you just use a blueprint. And you like That's put this insane. factory building. I don't know if it's gonna like cheat though and like just give us all the stuff that's inside for free, which would be kind of cheap, but. Yeah. Eh, I don't know. We shall see, I suppose. That would be kind of cheap, unfortunately. Oh, I see you gave me the factory building? Okay. Yes. Popped it in your pocket. I want this to look nice, so I'm going to use slightly more resources than are needed. Yeah, okay, fair enough. This is where we have to suspend our disbelief a little bit about factories within factories, but hey, whatever. <laughs> it's so cool, I don't care. <sighs> right, and oh my god, I'm making pipes. Nope, that's the worst thing ever. It's because underground pipes are so bloody expensive. Yeah, I need to. I'm gonna go steal some of your pipe from that factory up there. Oh gosh, it's, it's my hideous. pipe. What have you made? It's hideous. <laughs> <laughs> we need better like access to water or something. I don't know. It's because we're using this one tiny little freaking pond. <laughs> yeah, I know that's kind of dumb of us. We can heat. Here's the thing though: is we could just move everything so easily if we just yeah. set up all the water connections again. God. I think it's funny how uh, we're just spending so much time now focusing entirely on uh, this one little aspect, power. <laughs> yeah. But it's going to be great. It's going to be great. It's going to be great. There we go. We have... This factory looks insane from outside. There's just all these pipes leading into it at each side. It looks awesome. I love it. <laughs> That's insane. Oh, we don't have any actual coal leading into the thing. No, not yet. That's just gonna come in from the top, though. God. Yeah, these look pretty cool. Right, circuit network's finished. Um... Do we want solar energy? Uh, not if we're making a 40 megawatt factory building. Um, <laughs> let's, uh, let's go engine and we'll start pushing our way towards robots and trains. 
Okay. Yeah. I'm, one thing I'm very excited to see is what happens to the pollution map once we get this thing done. Yeah, because this should be pumping out an awful lot of pollution. Or none. Or none at all. Wah, wah, wah. I run out of pipe. There we go. As did I. I don't know how ah. I, I I don't have enough underground pipe now. Like how did I I feel like I've I've done that thing where I have an odd number. How did this yeah, happen? Yeah, you'll you'll just notice that you've got a daft one somewhere. Yeah. Oh. I I also had an odd number, so I probably finished something that you'd started. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I've made a terrible mistake. <laughs> This looks freaking gorgeous, doesn't it? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Uh, more pipe goes here, okay. And yeah, I'm back to an even number now. Okay, yeah. so <laughs> we just need coal. Lots of coal. We I don't even know if, if a yellow belt of coal is going to be enough from here. Probably not. Let's see it work! <laughs> Actually, like, I haven't been inside. Oh, there's nothing in this other factory. Okay. No, I still need to make the 60 steam engines. I've got enough <laughs> iron on me for 49. So I'll get it. I'm going to get started on them, but... Did you end up making a, a gear factory on its own? I'm going to do that. No, I didn't. I'll just... <laughs> I'll just sit in here with a big stupid smile on my face right now. <laughs> just watching as, all this. As well you should. <laughs> There's 50 of them. I'm gonna get started pocket crafting this crap. I just love these little dimensions. I feel so safe and happy in here. Magnificent. Alright, engines are finished. Um... Okay. What to get? Yeah. Trains, funnily enough, used to be something I never used in Factorio. No. Yeah, the um the issue being the base spawning, like the base um ore spawn meant yeah. that you could pretty much finish the game without any need. Yep. But with RSO, then, yeah, that's where it all changes. Yeah, and trains are fun. And we will need RSO for all of our factory factories. Factory Simo. <laughs> all this effort just to make a uh, <laughs> a forty megawatt power thing right now. So the only thing that I'm getting, I'm working on is trying to get this one thing done. I've got twenty on me. We've got ten outside. That's 30. We need another 50 steam engines. Oh God. That's 10 more. Okay. Need these gears. Ah, oh, you made another gear factory. Nice. Yeah. I'm just stealing some of the pipe right now to make it work because uh, I don't. I had I had a bunch of extra iron on me. So you know, I've got 30, 40. Okay, we're halfway there. And I pretty much have enough uh, gears and, and uh, pipe to actually finish this, which is awesome. So I've got all, all 40 more queued up. This is crazy. That's really all I have to say about that. <laughs> and the best part is we don't even need to use power lines in there. It's so nice. Yeah, I like that. It changes so many builds, though, because a lot of builds that you always use, use power lines. So you can fit seven across. Actually, uh, we're going to run into an issue here. I don't think we have enough room, do we? Oh, no. Yeah, look at this. Even if we do something like this, you need... Uh, Could not just put... Just fill up this entire space with them? 
Yeah, but look, like... Wait. No, it will fit. Holy crap. Wait, I did that wrong. Yeah, you did. It barely fits. You're right, though. It does. It, it will fit. And with long reach, we can actually manipulate this factory pretty easily. Um, and then this one's going to come down to here. Wait, no, I, I feel like we're getting off a little bit. I don't know, Stijo. I don't know if it's all going to fit. I don't think so. How is it that it... It's one, two, three, four. No, I can't fit four. I can't double this. There's no way I can fit this many in here. Why don't, like... I mean, I could do the seven. I, I mean, to utilize the space, I probably have to. Yeah, I put, just literally fill up the space. All right, let's see what happens. So that's the first one. I'm going to start hooking them up. That's the first one. And this one will go as far in as we can without intersecting the other set. So one, two, three. Yeah, okay, it'll work. Nice. That's, that's what it looks like. We have successfully made a 40 megawatt factory within a factory. <laughs> I'm going to get some pipes and pipe all this up. Oh, you're making unlimited underground. Oh, was I? What? You silly sausage. I wasn't making underground. Underground pipe? Oh, underground pipe. Gotcha. Okay. Thought you meant underground belt. No. Have I done my math wrong? I think I, I don't think I have enough. Uh... Oh, it's the ten steam engines that are already assembled. That's why. Yeah. Okay. I. And then the interesting thing is seeing if we can actually get power out of a factory instead of just in. I shouldn't see why I, not. I think it'll work. I'm optimistic. Gosh, there's like, there's not going to be any space in here at all. Literally none. <laughs> okay. Um, well, it's hooked up. Now we've got the last 10. Available performance, performance none. Okay. Yeah, apparently the only production we're getting is off of 10 steam engines. No. No. Sad face. So, like, why are the top ones not connected? Like, the top ones are saying available performance zero. There's no water coming in from the left. Why is there no water? Oh, these pipes. These not reach? These don't reach. Derp. Um, but why work on it if it's not going to work? I, we spent so much time on this, damn it! Um, do they need power lines to hook up to the grid? I mean, they are connected via power, so no, I just, I don't think they work inside. Why wouldn't they, though? That really sucks. I mean, I'm show yeah, it's showing available performance and performance none. They're just not being asked to work. What if, just let's just test this, what if you connect them inside the first factory? Maybe it's an issue with uh, the factory within a factory. Here, I'm gonna put like one steam engine, like here. No, he's not working either. Well, we could still, we could still bury all of the boilers inside of a factory building and just take carry the carry the power across yeah i mean yeah we could keep this and then have the output like the the boilers outputting i suppose well we uh kinda we're sad, sad now yeah. very sad <laughs> kind of sad this was so pretty 
I was so excited for a 40 megawatt portable little, literally one factory, but then another factory inside it. And all we'd have yeah. to feed is coal and water and just bam, 40 megawatts. It was so cool. <laughs> it's really sad watching you disassemble I know. all as well. <laughs> it's miserable. So apparently Aww. we got to put the steam engines in the real world. Okay. I mean, we can and have... Oh, we can't even do that. We can only have like... No, we got to cut four? it in half. Yeah. Yeah. Got to cut it in oh, half because we don't have enough... Out. Well, we could, do, we could do six in theory because we've got 12... We've got 12 inputs and outputs. So 12 waters in... Or six waters in, six waters out. We could do six per factory building. But we'd have so to completely change the layout that we're using. That's just uneven and yucky. Well, it's 30 megawatts, so it's still a pretty good number. Yeah, but if you put four in, four out, it's water goes on one side of a factory, the hot water comes out the other side of the factory, and it looks nice. Yeah, but you could also do the top two on the left being waters in, and the top two on the right being waters out, and then it's still symmetrical. Mm. You just you just don't like it, huh? Yeah. You'd rather just do four? Yeah. I'm going to just go cry for a while, that's all I'm going to do. Yeah. Now, what if you were inside a factory, right? And you have a pocket robo port. Can the robots help you deconstruct stuff inside a factory building? I wouldn't see why not. Because, like, they'll follow you, right? Like, they're going to be in here with you. Yeah. And this is a real place somewhere on the map. Or is it? <laughs> bum, bum, bum. Inception, is it really real or are we just in a dream? <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna have to go watch that movie after this recording session today. <laughs> <laughs> I think you've got my other factory, don't you? Yeah. Oh I yeah, power up. switches. I have never used them yet. No, neither have I. Somebody actually uh, made something where they were like, look at this, I made this thing that uh, measures the, free the, the throughput of a belt and if the belt throughput is is uh blocked and there's like nothing moving then it turns off all of the the factories so that they don't have any idle drain it's like wow that's a lot of work <laughs> just to save <laughs> the idle power drain <sighs> it's uh it's a lot of work there it's a lot of work there you did saying that i did spend like a billion episodes of the last series just making our oil trains ever so slightly more efficient <laughs> Yeah, I remember. So, Do you, uh... I can't really say anything about being a lot of work for not much payoff. Yeah. Do you want your, uh, this factory building back? No. Fuck. No. Not this one. You want a new one? Yeah. Blackjack and hookers. Pick up some steel. Oh, I can't because you changed the steel. There. I've turned steel back on. You can't stop me. Alright. Although it does mean that all this pipe that's getting built up here is no longer going to be pipe. Mm. Well, there's the, uh, the output water. Hot water now. Yay. Uh... Can you tell him? Still You're a not bit as excited. Yeah, <laughs> definitely. Definitely. I am too. Alright, so... Although, it might still reduce the... Yeah, the pollution all the happens pollution. inside, so... Yeah. Let's see, if we go like here... And then... We do need to run power lines now. Wow, this is gonna take up so much more space. <laughs> That's bullshit! <laughs> oh my god. Yes! See? Exactly! Stupid thing. Fuck you, fuck you, fuck you, and fuck you. There we go. Ah. <sighs> I know what you mean. You don't want to play this mod anymore, do you? 
It's rubbish. <laughs> fix, please fix, must fix. Please, please fix. Okay, and then then we gotta go even further down. Oh, hold on, I lined up. I think I lined it up a little bit off center. Shoot, I did. A yeah, big poop. No, I should have lined up the steam engine, the bottom edge. No, yes. Broke my steel tool. Anyway, if you want to take us out. Yeah, all right, okay. Well, we're going to go cry in the corner for a while, but we'll be back. <laughs> same time, same place tomorrow. We'll have more power, and it'll be good, and we'll Boom. find other things we can stick inside the factory. Yeah, so. blackjack. And hookers. All right, Yay. thanks for watching, everyone. We'll see you again tomorrow. See you soon. Bye-bye.